Hello everybody, Colin here from iOperReviews.com. As you can see, I am burning a DVD, which is the Linux Mint ISO. I'm going to burn it to a DVD, and I have over here my 2006 MacBook, and this is the hard drive with the Macintosh operating system on it. And I actually inserted a hard drive from my old Windows computer in there, and I'm going to try to boot it from the Linux DVD and maybe install it because I don't have a working Windows computer anymore. So we'll see how it goes and this video will be uploaded no matter what. Okay right now the disk is being verified and I will update you when the disk is actually ready to try to boot from. Okay so the disk is ready. I'm going to boot the computer and hold down option until the cursor comes up. I'm going to go ahead and put the disk in. It should show up to uh, be able to boot from it. So we'll get to that and I'll let you know. Okay, so I just clicked, it said Windows for some reason, but I just clicked on it and the screen went black. So hopefully it is booting and it is booting as you can see. So let's see what happens. At least I know I made the boot disk right. So, I'll let you know. So, it has gone through another boot menu, and we have a working cursor. So, um, I think we're good. Let's hope. Um, but I'm going to show you when we actually get something. Oh, there's. Looks like might be some kind of taskbar that might be starting to pop up. I'm going to try to get this installed. I think it is. Yep, okay, we have it booted with the correct date. The time is not correct, but I'm going to try to get it installed on the hard drive and let you know. Okay, I got it connected to the internet. And um, this is the installer. So we're going to continue. And we're going to erase any files. And that is the correct drive going to erase the drive and do a clean install of Linux and um, that's probably going to take a few minutes to 100 gig drive so I'm going to let you know actually I'm going to be done that's the correct time zone we went to English US and then I'm going to enter some of this information and return so that information is entered and my Macintosh operating system is still on this hard drive so I'm going to just safely put this hard drive somewhere over here in some bubble wrap just so um, I can have basically two computers in one just gonna put this over here so um we are making progress down there, so I'm going to let that completely finish, and uh, I'll be back to you. Okay, the thing on the clean install got stuck. I tried to do it uh, just on the regular hard drive. That's not working either. I'm going to try another clean install, but I don't know exactly what's wrong. So, I'm going to try it again. And now it's not even getting past this. I just get an input-output error. So, I'm going to try restarting and see what happens, but I may just have to use it off the disk. Let's see, did I get that error after I cancel that one? So I am starting it in integrity mode, which is, I guess, it's like a safe mode. So I'm going to try to erase the drive from there and then reinstall it. So it's booting up with all that stuff. Okay, guys, I got the same errors in compatibility mode. So I'm going to leave the video here as me being able to boot off a CD and use Linux Mint. And um, I'm just going to try it and I'll upload another video if I get it to work. Thanks for watching.